Good morning, World of Warcraft nerds. This is just a little video that I want to try to start doing every day, uh, especially if it's helpful for some of you. Uh, if you don't know, I am a huge fan of Delves in War Within. I think they are great content, especially for those of you who uh, don't normally do Mythic Plus or raiding. Uh, this is a wonderful little progression system that people get to play with their friends or whatever else. So this is just gonna be a quick little rundown of what story scenarios are available in every single delve that we currently have available as of season one. Uh, this is to help those of you that are maybe trying to get lore master or uh, the lore master of the delves or the glory of the delver, uh, which does have a weird looking mount attached to it, in my opinion. So if we look at the Isle of Dorn, we have the Earthcrawl Mines, which is going to be the story scenario Precious Ores, which is actually a very rare one. Uh, and I recommend doing it today if you haven't yet get that story achievement done. For Fungal Folly, we have Spreading the, the Decay, which is also a rarer one, and I would recommend doing it. It's not the rarest. There's another one that's even rarer, but Spreading the Decay is uh, is one that you need to do as well. And for today's Bountiful, we have Kriegval's Rest, uh, which is Swarming Kobolds, Probably one of the harder bountifuls that's available today because you have to deal with the taskmasters, uh, task finders, whatever they're called, the big kobolds with the frontal cone that kind of just two shots you or one shots you if you're uh, pretty low item level. So we have to watch out for those. It's also got the mechanic of the candle, which you can use the drop down. There's a little arrow in the objectives of the delve. You can hit that arrow to put the candle down while you're fighting. I would recommend doing that. It saves you a whole lot of stress. Next zone, we have the Ringing Deeps, which only has, of course, two delves in the entire zone. We have the Dread Pit, which is today's Bountiful, and that one is the Smashing Scarden story. So I would recommend doing that because that one is a little bit rarer. I recommend doing it. And also, interestingly enough, probably the easiest Bountiful ever is Dread Pit. Whenever you see that up, it's, it's kind of a free Bountiful, especially if you're doing Tier 8s. There is this Smashing Scarden, you get an extra action bar button that you can use. And you can use that to stun all of the Scarden that are there. Uh, and those actually give you about 13 or so XP each when they are defeated uh, towards Brand's, the, for Brand's XP. So potentially, I wouldn't recommend doing this, but if you need to get your Brand ca caught up, what you can do is you can run in on, uh, on Bountiful, doesn't really matter what tier, higher tier is probably gonna be better for XP. You can run in, gather them up, use the extra action bar to stun them all, they won't attack you, and you can just kill them all and then run out of the delve and reset it over and over and over again. So if you have a lower level de uh, brand Bronzebeard that you wanna get leveled, I would recommend doing the Dread Pit and just smashing this garden. Uh, I wouldn't do that anywhere over about level 45 or so. It's not worth. If your brand is lower, though, definitely highly recommend just farming Dread Pit and smashing those Skarden. There's like three giant packs as soon as you walk into the Delph. So it's really easy. Go do that. It's quick XP. Quick catch up for brand. And of course, we have the Waterworks, uh, which is the one of the harder delves, in my opinion, in its totality. Uh, this is not Bountiful this week, and the story for the Waterworks is Trust Issues. That is the scenario that we're looking at. Again, that's a difficult one because you have to deal with Wax Face at the end, uh, and you also have to deal with the mechanic of the, the air purification thing in that one. Uh, and then we have Hallowfall, which has a ton of delves. Mycomancer Cavern is going to be the bountiful for today, and that is also a very easy one. It is the great scavenger hunt, so you basically just need to collect some things. You can use the spores to kill enemies for you. Uh, so that is a very, very easy bountiful to do. So try to push that tier eight. Try to get to tier eight if you haven't yet. Uh, that's a really, really easy one to do, and the final boss of that delve is very easy as well. Then we have the Skittering Breach, and the story for that is Renalash Beckons. So if you haven't done that yet, you can do that. Skittering Breach, uh, you just have to avoid the big purple circles. 
Don't walk into those or else you'll get targeted by uh, darkness pools that will go after you. That one's not too bad either. And then, of course, we have Nightfall Sanctum. Uh, Nightfall Sanctum this week, or today, I should say, is Chiron's Assault. So if you haven't done that yet, you can go do it. Similar as the uh, a similar thing of needing to avoid dark circles. Um, and then we have the Sinkhole here. The Sinkhole story is Rain's Gambit. So, uh, Rain's Gambit. That's an underwater delve. So, I would recommend picking up the Drainic Water Breathing Potion. They're about 40 or so gold, depending on your server. Those are incredibly helpful uh, for any of these delves uh, that are underwater. So, I would recommend that. And finally, we have Ajkahet, the Spiral Weave. The story for that one is From the Weaver with Love. So if you haven't done that story yet, definitely do so. And also pay attention because there are, I believe, two treasure chests near the end of the delve that in this that you can only get in this scenario. So if you also need all of the treasures for all of the delves, make sure you do the spiral weave. Next, we have the Takrathan Abyss, which is actually one of my favorite delves to do. I think it's uh, very simple as long as you're dealing with the necromancers and not pulling extra um, but Takrathon is really easy. It's another uh, water breathing one, and it is today's Bountiful. So you can check that one out. Uh, again, really, really recommend uh, the the water breathing potion. And when you get to the final boss, it's pretty easy. Just get out of the conal, get out of its AOE explosion around itself, and watch to make sure shrooms aren't underneath you when those spawn, because they kind of just one-shot you. So be careful of those. Uh, but overall, that's not a bad one. The story for that one today is... Uh, Niffin Napping. Yep, Niffin stuff. And finally, we have the Underkeep, the last one of today. Uh, and that one is Weaver Rescue. So if you need the story for that, go ahead and get it done. And that's it for today, September 25th, NA Region Delves. Get delving, nerds. <laughs>